Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and we're back here with some Dying Light 2. Uh, last episode we met up with uh, Hackon and uh, we had a nice little fight with him and uh, needless to say, we won. Uh, I also don't know why I got told this was a danger area. So I'm kind of terrified right now. Uh, right when I loaded up the game, it said that this was a danger area, so... I don't really know what's going on. Um... But, uh, yeah, so for today's episode, we are... Our objective... Oop, that's the pause menu. Our objective is... To report to Frank. So, we've defeated Hackon, so now we just have to leave the church. Um... And run all the way over there. The only problem is it is at night. What time is it? Uh, is it a map that tells you what time it is? It is 8.44 in the morning. So that means that the sun should theoretically be coming up. I hope the sun's up. It is up awesome. Frank? Where you been, kid? Waiting for you at the fisheye. Get over here. Yeah, uh, Look, a lot went down since we last spoke. Fuck. What happened? Are you okay? <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. And you won't believe this, but Luan was there and she let Hakon go. She what? Yeah, she destroyed her kill list. I'm floored. Save your shock for later, Frank. What about that doctor? You... Yeah. <clears throat> Here we go. All right. All right, so we got to get to the fish eye, which is this way. So I'm going the complete opposite direction of where I'm supposed to be going. What is that? Is that a zombie or is that a person? I have no idea. So we're still on the scuff controller. We're still on the old Call of Duty controller, so we are not going to be the greatest when it comes to everything, because I still gotta get used to everything, but that's okay. We'll make no do. Way. You me? So, I hope you guys did enjoy the last episode. Um, what the hell's going on here? Um... The last episode was, it wasn't the longest, I think it ended up being after editing about like an hour and a couple of minutes, so it wasn't super, super long, but it was a decent length, I think, for a video, I feel like, you know, an hour isn't too, too bad, um, but, you know, we'll try and make this one a little bit longer, yesterday I was kind of running short on time, I had to edit the video, and I had to, um, you know, download and all that. And I had work. So, oh shit. Get off of me. The hell's wrong with you? Bitch. Up and now you're all up. All right, up, I'm out of here. All right, well, you took forever to pull out that parachute. How do I use these? Oh, you just jump. All right. Yeah, screw it. We'll rescue you. Ooh, I grappled over. Oh, that's a big guy. Why do I trip? I don't understand. Hold your buddy for me. This music is so calming. I don't know why <laughs> we're in a fight with this relaxing ass music. I don't know if you guys are hearing what I'm hearing, but. Let me go. Hang in there, buddy. Oh, shit. There we go. You're safe, buddy. You're safe. Get your ass out of here. All right, and we're back on the road. 
That shit's so cool. Doesn't really do a whole lot, but it's pretty cool. All right. So from what we last heard, that there was some GRE scientists back at the bazaar, which was back in the old Villador. So we're probably going to have to go back there. I don't know exactly how we're going to get there. But um, I guess we'll find a way. It says that it's raining, but it's just... Oh, here. Eh, maybe it is. I don't know. It doesn't seem like it. The ground's wet, but I don't see any raindrops. I'm kind of happy I came this way, because I would have never found this. I only got one. Go figure, right? No, go back to sleep. Go back to sleep. Go back to sleep. Go to sleep. <laughs> Sit your bitch ass down. All right. Fish eye, fish eye, where are you at? Aiden, climb up the damn thing. Aiden, you there? Meet us at the bar. Us? Who's us? Alright, well, we finally made it. Took long enough, but we made it. It was a long ass walk back. So, let's head back in. We also need to go to our player stash. I want to see what item I got. Um, okay, he's right there. Okay, we're good. we'll go to our bed after. We'll go see what he, what's up. Be one of us someday, Aiden. We'll make a decent runner, won't he, Lawan? Huh? Ah, oh, the best. But as for today, hey, everyone, I wanted to say something. Hey! Everybody, hey! <sighs> hey! Shut up, all of you! <sighs> Frank's got something to say. By whatever authority remains in me, I hereby make Lawan. Officially and forever, a night runner. The fuck yes! Yeah. Yeah. Get the fuck out! Give him a beer! Frank? Uh, you mean. So, you're really bringing back the night runners? No, you're bringing them back. You and Aiden, in fact. You've already started. These old bastards are all former night runners who heard my broadcasts and came back. But you. You did them one better. You grew up. <laughs> Fuck you. See? The creed. If Hakon's alive, it means you learn to forgive. You found balance. That's what being a night runner is really all about. What about you, Frank? Do you forgive? Your timing always sucked, Hakon. Sometimes, but maybe not this time. I thought you could use this. Where'd that come from? I've kept it with me all along, Frank. So what will it be, Chief? If Luan can forgive you, <laughs> I guess I have no choice. Not a ringing endorsement, but I'll take what I can get. Good. Now, this is Lawan's time, not yours. Step back and shut up. <laughs> Everybody, get your asses up to the roof. Much better place for a ceremony than a fucking bar. Oh, yeah! That's awesome, dude. The Night Runners are back. To serve a cause greater than myself. Today, I am forged anew. To serve a cause greater than myself. I shall be the sword that slays the enemies of mankind. I shall be the sword that slays the enemies of mankind. I shall be the shield 
behind which humanity rises again. I shall be the shield behind which humanity rises again. I shall be the light in the darkness. I shall be the light in the darkness. This is my sacrifice. This is my sacrifice. This is my pledge. This is my pledge. As a night runner. As a night runner. Out of the job. I'm gonna make you proud. You already have, and I say that calls for celebration. Everyone, back down to the bar. Hayden, the GRE doctor I told you about. It's Veronica Ryan. She lives in Old Villador. Are you kidding me? What? Well, she's one of the first people I met here. We were acquainted once. She used to come to the canteen. I guess I managed to avoid pissing her off during my booze hound days, because I convinced her to help you. Can we talk before you leave, Aiden? Yeah, I mean... Uh, sure, yeah. Mm, seems serious. Talk to you later, kid. Good what do you mean, seems serious? So, congratulations. Sorry for avoiding you. I just... You know what they say. If you're starting to worry about someone, it means it's time to go. Yeah. That's a pilgrim saying. Neither of us need to worry anymore. Yeah, having Hakon back must be weird. <laughs> Tell me about it. Spent so much time wanting to kill him. But maybe, you know, maybe I never did because I never really wanted to. Maybe all I ever wanted was to stop hurting. Well, um, uh, are you hurting now? Not really. Itchy, maybe. Like, when an infection's healing. But I'm not in pain for the first time in... I don't know how long. So you're officially a night runner. How's that feel? <laughs> so strange. For so long, it was just Frank. And the night runners were just a ghost story of his. Now, we're like a fucking Insta family. Even hack on, for fuck's sake. Can you believe it? Yeah, we'll get all sweet up in this bitch. Go on, I... I was worried. Here it comes. When you left, after, um, after your place, I... Hack-ons and my place. <laughs> yeah, I can say that now. If I can say that, then it proves that you don't have to worry about me. Hmm, there we go, sweets. Yeah. Of course I do, especially now. I mean... I'll take it from a pilgrim. Happy people are vulnerable people. Aren't you a buzzkill? I didn't no, mean it like that. that! After everything, I just... I just don't want to see you hurt again. <laughs> Next time I get hurt, I ain't gonna piss around so long before I kill the fucker. I guess I better quit while I'm ahead. Look, I'm sorry I bailed on you. I was just... No, it's okay. It was really none of my business. But I made it your business. When I took you there. Maybe I did it on purpose. On purpose? You've made me, and Frank, all this, your business. And look how much all of us have gained. Maybe I... I wanted you to know. But I was too chicken shit to come out and tell you so. And so... we went shoe shopping. <laughs> Right. Those fucking shoes. They look good on you. Okay. I've... I gotta go. I... To look for your sister, right? Sometimes I... Envy her. Envy her? How? That... She means so much... To someone. I'm sorry. Fuck, I'm talking bullshit. No, no. You're not, uh... Just shut up. Thank you. Frank's got something for you, Aiden. Yeesh. 
The one. They're waiting for you downstairs. I'm coming, Hakon. Fuck. You oh, yes! Don't do anything, Aiden. And good luck. Right now, I think I just gotta do my thing. No! Bitch, get back over here! The more things change, the more they stay the same. Hey, eh, kid? Uh, Frank found that doctor you were looking for. Veronica Ryan. Seems she used to work for the GRE. And I thought I knew everything about the women in this city. You can probably find <laughs> her somewhere around the church. Wait, she kissed us, right? That's a dub, boys! Fucking let's go, Aiden, you I son of a bitch! Oh, let's go, baby! Woo! <laughs> let's go! I've wanted that shit to happen in this game the whole time, dude. Holy shit. You may have a hang All right. But your wallet won't Do you have anything for me? Upgrade. Uh, paraglider. Military tech. We have three out of two. We have 1,100. What, what else do I have? The UV flashlight and the grappling hook. I don't really need to upgrade these things. I think the paraglider is the most important. Let's upgrade nice. that. Hope All right. you enjoyed your visit. The next stuff we should buy is uh, another safe weapon. Wait, why? Speciality items right here. Wait, why is it bringing me to this? Trade. No. Trade. Ain't nothing I won't sell you, honey. I don't know what the hell was wrong with that. This is gold. It's only 10 lower. Yeah, we'll get this. And I can also go buy something from the bazaar when I get there. Taste. What's this? Fire resistance. Electricity resistance. Um, this is actually good for us. We could buy that. Strength and guards. That one's up three. I think we should buy one of those. Yeah, fuck it. We'll buy these. Your wish is my command. I can also sell you some know. stuff. Uh, I don't have that much, actually. All right, we still got 4,000. So, that's good. Um, let's go to our inventory now. Let's, let's see. This thing still got a decent amount of life. That's good. Um... Actually, yeah, let's modify this. Actually, no. Let's take... Which one's the weakest one? This is the weakest one. Let's put this in there. And then put this in there. And then let me upgrade these. Modify. Uh, spark, flame, voltage. So, spark. Shaft. Inferno. And we don't have anything for the grip. But we do have a charm. So we'll toss out a charm here. Alright. We got that one. Now let's do this one. Let's do this. We gotta get a lot of stuff. I think we need to loot. We don't really have too much stuff. Um, let's do Venom. And for the charm, we'll go with this. Go electric with this one and inferno with this one as well sweet all right we're good all right let me do let's go to the player stats because you'll see what we got um where would that be it's the wands room um ouch where's our room That's alright, I know where it is at the fish eye. We'll go there and grab it. Alright, so we gotta go. Jeez, you gotta be shitting me. 1.3 kilometers away. Morning, Aiden. Morning, honey. I don't know who you are, but good morning. Uh, sometimes it would be nice to have a. Alright, let's rock and roll. I don't know why my glider wasn't pulling out, bro. I don't know why this game is like lagging. 
Hello, hello, hello. Who's texting me? Sorry, I'm getting a lot of text messages right now. Let's go up. I mean, the last time we got over here was chasing Walt, so I don't really know how we're going to get back over there. Let's take a look. Are we going to take the same way we did to get over here? Am I going to get there, though? We're moving a little bit quicker now. Keep going up. Get more height. Let's go. Nice. Let's get that music going. You bitches never seen shit like this before, have you? Feel like a changed man with this upgrade. Wow, stamina's actually a lot better now. And I feel like we're moving a lot faster. You can just fucking fast travel. You gotta be joking me. I did all that just to be able to fast travel. Entrance, you guys see that shit? Yeah, I'm doing improved, bitch. All right, we made it. It was Vincenzo. You were supposed to be discreet, not go shouting in the middle of the bazaar. All right, hold up. They surprised me. How was I supposed to know they? We're gonna go look at the stash, see what we got, because I think that'll be good for us to, if it's a weapon, check out. Inventory. This is what I got equipped. Extras. What's this? All right, I think we're good. All right, let's look around here. She outside, maybe. Pilgrim. Barney! What brings you, pal? Oh, I could just ask anyone, I guess. How's life? Better? Now that the PK finally stopped bothering us. I'm even thinking of starting my own business. I know a bit about weapon design. I could start making and selling them. Sounds good. Barney, I know we had our differences in the past. But dude, you are probably up there one of my favorite characters in this game. Just because you're such a badass. And uh, how's Sophie doing? Besides oh, yeah. Lawan, <laughs> you know she's my girl. She's the big boss now. <laughs> I'm sure she is. After all that happened, folks finally realized we needed a real leader. I'd say things have turned out the way they always should have been. Well, good for her. And for all of old Villador. I'm looking for Dr. Veronica Ryan. You're not the only one, man. What do you mean? The good doctor's in trouble. And, uh, weird kind of trouble. You see, a group of renegades appeared in Old Villador. First, we braced ourselves for another battle. But they didn't attack the bazaar. Just asked for Dr. Ryan. Of course, we didn't tell them where she is. And where is Veronica? <laughs> you can tell me, right? In a hideout. Vincenzo and a few of our people are protecting her there. Oh, that's where Vincenzo but the less is. people know about that place, the safer she is. Where is it, Barney? If the renegades are hunting Veronica, a few people may not be enough. You just can't walk away from a fight, can you? Nope. The building is north of Quarry End. Courtesan Rose Street. But you didn't hear it from me. Barney, you are the man. And you? Why are you here and not with Vincenzo and the rest? I want it to be. But Sophie talked me out of it. Said something about not wanting them to have to deal with my attitude. <laughs> what attitude, for fuck's sake. <laughs> I have no idea. 
I love Barney. Thanks for the info. I'll go and give him a hand. The folks say I'm the one always itching for a fight. Anyway, good luck, man. You know, I like Barney a lot. You know, at first thought we thought that he was the one that was the, um, you know, the bad guy. Because he just seems that way. And the game did that on purpose, obviously. But uh, now that we know, obviously, it wasn't him. You know, Barney's obviously warmed up to us a little bit. And he's actually a really good guy in the game. And I actually really like him as a character. So, we made it back. Now it's time to go find this doctor. The thing with this place is that uh, there's not really a lot of places to jump from in high places. And of course, why wouldn't this thing be 500 meters away? I do want to loot all this stuff, but you know what? I, I might just loot off camera. I might just take some time, go loot off camera. Uh, get some stuff that we might need to upgrade and all that good stuff. Because we are in some desperate need of some parts and stuff like that. And we really don't have them. Almost halfway there. We also got some skill points that we gotta take care of in a minute. Go, 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 go. Oh! That is freaking cool. I just wanted to see what that was. It was freaking awesome. Come on in. Ah, shit. Yep. There we go. I love that little running up the wall type of thing. That's awesome. Okay, we gotta go this way. Should be right up here, I think. They should be in this building. One of these buildings over here. Yep. Here we go. Look at that. Perfect landing. Is that a renegade? Oh, shit. Wait, how did you hear me? How did you hear me? It was a stealth takedown, bitch! Get out of here! Where's your boys? Or is it just you? Oops. Wait, it's out of the blast mod thing. Do I only get one use of that? I'll let you live, I'll let you live. Feeling nice today. Actually, nah, you guys all fucked me up. Eh, you were empty anyways. You were not worth it. Alright, well, they found her, so I'm hoping to God that she's not dead. First try. Oh, boys! How we doing? Oh, shit. Okay, well, I can't use my blast thing, so hold up. Oh, I found out how to charge. Ouch. Uh, this one. Shit. Okay, I'm, I'm chalking this right now. Hold up. I'm trying to be fancy and use my shit, and it's just not working. So.
Oh shit, I didn't even mean to do that. Oh yeah, this thing's overpowered now. Y'all done fucked up now, bitches! Woo! Oh, you still alive? Nah, bitch, you fucking thought? Anything around here for me? Something over here? Here we go. Oh Aiden. no. Vincenzo, please don't die on me. Thank God. We where's Veronica? She managed to escape. I need to find her. Do you know where she is now? No. But we can try to contact her. Veronica? Veronica? Are you safe? Veronica. <sighs> Shit. Something's not right. Yes. I'm safe. Are you? Oh, I am now. There is someone who needs to speak to you. Jesus, Dr. Ryan, you don't look good, man. I'm Aiden. I know that you're being hunted by the renegades. Hurry, Aiden. More renegades may be here any minute. Frank told me you worked for the GRE. I need access to the GRE database in the observatory. I, I have a GRE key. A GRE access key. That's what I've been told. You think you can... Let's meet. I'll be in a small building near the dam, not far from the observatory. Okay, I'll go... Wait, hello? Be careful, Aiden. The place is soaked in chemicals. I will. Thanks for the heads up, Vincenzo. Thank you. I'm lucky you showed up. Farewell, Aiden. I better Farewell. see your ass in your shop in like two minutes after this mission. I swear to God, here, I'm shutting this door for you, buddy. They ain't gonna find your ass, I promise. Okay, how am I gonna get up there? Can I run up? Yep. Alright. Oh, there's more of you. Hello, bitches! Ooh, okay. Yeah, fuck your boy. Yeah, how's that feel? Yeah. Bitches. There's only two of you? Sorry, Vincenzo, I'm protecting your ass. I ain't gonna let them kill you. How did I get into this place? Wasn't it through here? Yeah, it was through here. Why is that blocked off now? Alright, she's over here. How far is this? Dude! Are you serious? All right, well, I mean, yeah, I, I have no idea if I'm going in the right direction or not. I hope to God I am because I have no fucking clue where else I'm supposed to go, if not here. And we're all the way back from where we first met Waltz. This is that tunnel. I had to run all the way over here. My little happy ass. Aiden, where are you? Oh, thank God, it's the right area. Meet me, and then we'll go to the observatory. That's the place you're looking for. But the observatory's soaked in chemicals. Find me in the two-story building squeezed between the dam and the promenade. <sighs> I have to go search for your bitch ass. How far am I? Still got up. Oh, they built a bridge. I don't have to do that parkour anymore. That's crazy. No way. That's awesome. You go up and down with that. Um, I don't want to see what's over here. And I guess I never will.
You gotta be able to jump on that. I, I honestly think you can. The fuck am I? No shot. It spawned me all the way over here. Is this a fucking joke to you, game? I just ran for fucking 15 minutes. You sick bastard game. I regret jumping off so fucking much now. Oh my. I had literally been running across the map for 15 minutes. I fucking shit you not. What the fuck is that? All right, well, I made my super happy ass back over here. Alright, where am I supposed to go? I have to go this way. But I cannot go this way by dropping down. You can climb this though. I think, I honestly think I have to go. I have to go this way. There's no other way. Are you fucking kidding me? Aiden, you son of a bitch, grab the fucking ledge! I would just like to say that I am completely bullshitted right now. This is absolutely ridiculous. I can't believe I have to I've had to run my fucking ass over here three fucking times. Alright, let me upgrade my fucking skill point. Is there a damn thing that's gonna turn 180? That is not gonna help me at all climb that thing. What is this? Make the last climb. Oh, shit, bitch! You think we need that? Because I fucking do. Because we can't even hold on to shit when we fucking fall. I'm so annoyed that I'm probably not even making any sense at this point. Don't get me wrong, I still love this game, but holy fuck is this annoying. I'm about to find some place to climb up and paraglide over there. This roof's looking real nice. Can I climb up on this? Yep. For the love of God, don't fuck me, please. Thank you. Hold up. No, in my luck, this bitch is gonna collapse. I am taking this shit slow as fuck. Is there anything for me to loot? I don't even care, it's hard. I will spend. If I'm coming over here, I better I might as well get some fucking shit. I had to fucking restart my damn journey three fucking times. Better have some good shit in this bitch. MRE rations. Where do you want me to go? 
What do you want me to do? Dude, if I'm going the wrong fucking way, I'm gonna be so mad. It's you. Had a feeling we'd cross paths sooner or later. You patched up Barney, right? He whimpered like a baby as soon as he saw the needle. And those renegades, why are they after you? Probably the same reason as you. To access the GRE database. What do you want from it, Aiden? Why are you risking so much? I'm looking for my sister. Your sister was in the GRE? She... No, she was a prisoner. I haven't seen her in 15 years. A prisoner? You mean a test subject? I don't know what I'll find. She's... She's the only family I've got. The only answer to what Waltz has done to us. Waltz? He held us there. Had a hobby of experimenting on kids. Did you know about that? I was only a mid-level doctor, Aiden. I'm sorry. Want to know anything else? Or can we go? Why are you helping me? Are you looking for something in the database as well? Aiden, those vaults contain my organization's biggest secrets. I almost died because I was a part of it. I need to know what they were hiding. What if you don't like what you discover? Nothing ventured, nothing gained. How did a GRE doctor wind up at the bazaar? By not letting anyone know I was a GRE doctor. After the revolution, the GRE were blamed for the disaster. Personnel were rounded up and... executed. People used revenge to relieve the pain. Doesn't matter if it doesn't work. What happened, happened. Now I'm someone else. How are you planning to get us inside the observatory? Look, there's a security tunnel into the complex. It was locked up years ago. Give me the key, Aiden. What? Are you sure the key is functional? Well, it has been. Maybe the problem is that the building has no electricity. Oh, no, you don't Is there think. any other way to get in there? It depends how much we're prepared to risk. A lot, if you ask me. Okay. Then come with me. I have something to show you. Oh shit, the fucking building needs power, stupid. The fuck did you get up this real quick? Holy shit, bitch, you could have at least waited. See those domes? Sure, but the place is flooded with chemicals. The GRE had a solution for that. When they created the THV Gen Mod, they had to protect their employees from exposure. But the THV what? The chemicals. They came up with blockers. Shots that would shield their workers for a few minutes from the fumes. No shit. Fortunately, I still have two doses. Had a feeling they'd come in handy one day. Well, those must be worth a pretty penny. They are extremely rare. For now, we will need only one. For you. Wait, you're not coming? No, I, I will join you, but... First, I'd like you to restore the power to the building. Well, it's always me. You see, I... have panic attacks when I'm in tight spaces or in the dark. <laughs> now you probably think I'm a coward. Nah, bitch, me all. too! I think it took guts to come here. Those volatiles are in there waiting for my ass. <laughs> when you get there, first restore the power. Then I'll be able to join you. Hold out your arm. Remember, the shot shields you from the chemicals for a limited time only. Can't I take the other one too? No, not at the same time. This stuff's too strong. Go as fast as you can to the smaller dome, and from there to the higher one. You should find a door leading inside. There. You'll be safe. Then head to the B block. There you should find the building's main circuit breaker. 
As soon as you turn on the electricity, the security door will unlock, and I can join you by going through the tunnel I showed you. Now go. The blocker is working. <sighs> the blocker is working. That blocker won't protect you forever. I have 54 seconds to do this? <coughs> Alright, I think I gotta go up this way, right here. Oh, right there. I made it through the chemicals to the first dome. Great. Now just get to the second one. Find a door, a hatch, or whatever leads underground. Right. <laughs> yep, you need that. Veronica, found the entrance. So far, so good. But how do you know this place so well, by the way? I was here just once, long ago. But I have a good memory. That sounds useful. Well, sometimes it's a curse. Really. God. Well, this should be fun. Veronica? I have a horde of infected here. Shit. I hoped it would be empty by now. Well, it isn't. I don't know if I can get through. Use the UV flashlight on your belt. That should keep them at bay. Just don't stop, Aiden. Touching me, bitch. Go, go, go. They can't come through here, right? If one of them runs through there, I'm a, I'm a fucking shit myself, I swear to God. Alright, well, this still doesn't help. There's still fucking a hundred of them down here. Do I just kill these guys? I think killing them might... No, I wanted to assassinate! Oh shit. No more runners. It's already creepy enough down here without them. Fuck off me, bitch. Back up. Back up. You seem like a pain in the ass, so I'm gonna take your ass out. Back up. I think it's all of them. Let's get in here. It's a lockpick. Go figure. Go. The fuck was down there? Oh, it's zombie. Come on! They are freaking out down there. Oh no. Oh 
You guys stop screaming? You're giving me a fucking headache. Oh shit, fuck yeah. Hey Veronica, I made it. The electricity's on. Great. The security tunnel is open. Oh, I didn't know that was gonna happen. I would have done that sooner. Yeah, this place was quite the hive. Plenty of infected. But I got rid of them. They were people too, Aiden. They deserve respect. No, they don't deserve any respect, bitch. You see that big motherfucker right there? He would have killed my ass. I see. I think it blew a fuse. I'm checking. Do something. Quick. Please. There's no don't volatiles. Worry. I'll fix it. Please. Don't leave me here. Don't be afraid. I just need a moment. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. Bitch, I don't need you having a panic attack in my ear. Trying to lock back. Oh, I'm back. Oh, it's back there. Fuck! Aiden! Do something! Let me out! Bitch, I'm trying to figure I'm this shit out. Just let me out! Let me out! I'm I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Hands here, Veronica. Try to breathe. Slowly. Uh, uh, oh, wait, all this stuff. The electricity's don't off. Leave me. Just don't leave me here! Shouting won't do anything except attract infected. Yeah, calm down. I won't leave you. Is it this thing I gotta fuck with you? Hmm. Maybe up here? And jump over to this? I think I could've just climbed this to begin with, but whatever. you by the elevators. Everything would work out. Just get in. What are you pissed at me for, bitch? Next time I'll leave your ass. Calm her down. You always been claustrophobic? Seriously? For over 10 years. So what happened then? Aiden, for God's sake, can we not talk about this right now? Bitch, I'm trying to help your bitch ass. Uh, the database. Where is it? Just give me a moment. Listen, I would give you a moment, but the game didn't let Below me. Below us. Even farther than this? Another six floors down. This is pretty high tech. Before the GRE, this complex was run by the military. They used it to monitor threats, rocket attacks, that sort of thing. That's why they called it the Observatory. Then the virus came, and that was the end. 
Listen, bitch, I'm not really liking the attitude I'm receiving for trying to help, okay? So, what happened here, in the end? Well, the GRE lost control of the situation, and it all went to hell. Everything collapsed. From what I know, the scientists at first barricaded themselves inside. But huh. soon, conditions in here were as bad as they were in the city. So, some of them quietly slipped out. And those who stayed are the ones you got rid of earlier. So the military ran this place before the GRE? Yes. It used to be a Cold War command bunker. Cold War? A period in the last century. Wars back then were fought on a grander scale. It wasn't just about day-to-day -day matters like having enough water, UV lamps, and food scraps. In a way, though, it was just like things are now. People lived every day in constant fear. That's quite the story. They used to call places like this witnesses to history. Great. Dark again. Wait. I'll try and figure something out. Uh. If we have electricity here, we could use it to power up the whole floor. Can I open these? I open that. Imagine I could open all of these. That'd be fucking rich. Alright, so we can only open one. I gotta go up there, so let's open this up. There we go. There she is. We need to open this door. Okay, so let me grab this before I go up there because I'm probably going to need to do this. It's a tight fit in here. All right, wait. I'm out of I'm out of line here. All right, maybe maybe I gotta open up the door first to do that. This is some creepy shit, dude. Aiden, drop down. Ooh. Hello. I'm gonna loot as much as I can because I do need some stuff while I'm here because I feel like this is gonna be a very high valuables place. There's gonna be a lot of valuables here. So. I think looting here is gonna be smart because I don't think we're gonna be able to come back. Plug this cable in. It might work. How do I get in there, though? Nothing in here for me. Ooh. How do I get in there?
this from here? I don't know how to get over to that room. Veronica, how you holding up? Just want to get to that database and get out of here. You're doing great. Just talk to me. Why are you really helping me? You're taking quite a risk. Frank told me it was important to you. And that's it. You probably don't know much about Frank and the Night Runners. We owe him, well, everything. Alcohol, we need that. Is there any way up? Oh, there's right here. Oop, yep. There we go. Okay, hold on. Before we do that. Yeah, no, that's our only choice. Son of a bitch. Infected. That's good. All right. Just gotta plug it in now. Routing the circuit. Yeah, saved my life a few times. Veronica, should we get going? Yes. Let's get this over with and then get out of here. This way. The main computer is there. You'll finally know what happened to your sister. She's all I have. What about your parents? I don't remember them. Just her. We. We were a good team. Without her, it's like, uh... God, I don't know. You don't know what? Well... I don't really know who I am. We're all different people than we were 15 years ago. We all got... lost. I can climb over that. It's here. Oh, or I could just walk right in. Oh, sweetheart. Okay, we're good. It's locked again. <sighs> what now? The terminal is inactive. The security system isolated this area. Uh, I guess I'm up. Yep. I've got an idea. Try to find the officer's room. There's a security desk. We could try to operate the door locks from there. You should be able to use your GRE key on it. You sure know a lot about this building. Please, just insert the key and select emergency unlock on the screen. I'll explain everything to you when we're done. I don't know, you're acting weird, lady. I knew this room had something. Still can't open that door. It worked. 
Yeah, but we may have another problem. I'm stuck here. I need to find a way out. Can I help you somehow? I don't think so. Just stay where you are. Nice. Zombie room, aren't we? Yep. No way you don't see me. Slide. Director, Field Laboratories Department. A mid-level GRE doctor, my ass. Seems to be Veronica's office. You weren't honest with me, Veronica. Who's that boy? Maybe her son? Aiden. A funny thing. Seems there was another Veronica Ryan. Director. Field Labs Department. I was going to tell you. Why are you helping me? Are you working with Waltz? Waltz? No, never. Even back then, I didn't. Waltz had his own research team. But you knew about the experiments, how they used kids. <laughs> me and my sister. That's why I'm here, Aiden. I... I cannot forget what we did here. That we let you down. All those kids in pain and no cure to show for it. Cure? We were five, for fuck's sake. Small children showed natural immunity to the virus. We saw a correlation between age, brain development, and infection severity. That's why they were experimenting on you. The GRE, the world, needed you. You seemed our only hope. I'm sorry. So that's why we don't see any, like, kids as zombies. Was it worth it? I mean, did you even come close to a cure? We were close. But the virus... It finally reached the complex. So, were you involved in those experiments? No. The tests on children were all performed at a laboratory. Here we were gathering data and compiling research. I was here when it all happened. Team members began to turn. And things quickly spiraled out of control. One by one, we were locked inside, hiding, sneaking around through those dark corridors and ventilation shafts. My son, he was here with me. Mm. Paul, he was five back then too. What happened to him? I managed to find the shaft leading to the main entrance. I told Paul to wait for me. I kissed him, and I told him to wait until I made sure the entrance was safe. He clung to me, didn't want to let me go. When I came back for him, he was gone. I was only away for 15 minutes. 
I spent the next week looking for him. And then the rest of my life crying. I should have known. He was a kid. Scared. Alone. I'm sorry. You were trying to take him out of here. How could you know? Anyway. We all have our own stories of the past. Let's concentrate on what happens next. Okay. Let's go. Ah, oh, you're a ciggy smoker. You nasty bitch. Oh, there's a crate in here. Hold up. I don't know how I missed this before. Ah, you bitch! So, um, I'm going in? Hope you find what you've been looking for. All the GRE's data is in there, Aiden. Oh. Sorry guys, I'm yawning. I, I didn't get much sleep. I'll try it again. You can squeeze through there. It's stuck. <laughs> Fuck it, I'll go. No, wait. I'm done waiting. It's time for answers. Oh wow. Here we go. Infection detected. Veronica, what's, what's going on? Talk to me, Veronica. Are you okay? It looks like we tripped an alarm. Decontamination procedure. Decontamination procedure? Well, that can't be good. It's not. Chemical decontamination's deadly. Well, well, how do we stop it? I don't know. Veronica? Veronica! You remain calm. You remain calm. Bitch, Veronica? my left's on the line. I can't stop it. Do something! So think faster. Blockers. I still have one. You have to find one for yourself. Uh, any idea where to look? The control room. Maybe they kept some there. Go. Find the okay, control room. Combination procedure ready to begin. Find a way up. I can go up there. Control room upstairs. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Shit. That's smart having the yellow screen. No! I'm dead. Dude, for fuck's sake. What the fuck is that? This game, this, uh, I woke up today, decided, hey, let me fucking chill on a dying light today instead of stressing out on Call of Duty. Yeah, why don't you just get fucked in the ass, Ange? I know, I fucking know. I fucking chalked it again! <laughs> this is... This is fucking unreal! I'm gonna lose my motherfucking marbles. Alright, I have an idea. Alright guys, this is my fucking idea. This is my fucking idea. I know, I fucking know! All right. All right. No, 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 Aiden. 
I don't have the stamina. Yes! 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 I found one. That's it. All right, now comes the fun part. My god, dude, thank fucking god I got that shit done. I <laughs> when I started wall running, dude, I thought Aiden. I was fucked. Aiden, you alright? Yeah. Yeah, I, I used the blocker. Thank god. I think we're safe now. That's good to hear. Ready to plug in? Are you serious? Yeah, do it. Cross your fingers, Aiden. The moment of truth. The moment of truth was a pain in the ass. Damn, it's broken. Oh no, you shit me. <laughs> I did all that for nothing. System. Wait. Give me the key. Authorization granted. Holy fuck. There is a list of patients and personnel. Who do you wanna check first? Mia. Search for Mia. Is that your sister? Yes. Nothing. Impossible. She was there, with me. <sighs> I'm searching. Sorry, Aiden. Records show no patients named Mia. Oh my god, I did all this for nothing. God. It's impossible. Let's do us then. I will check my name, Aiden. Aiden. Uh, there's one record? Among the youngest children, year 2020. Aiden Caldwell? Is that your surname? Well, it is now. What does it say? <laughs> it is now. Data classified. Only one note. Warning. Patient shows an above average tolerance to the substance. Most tests performed. Exemplary results. Yes, I'm extraordinary. What about my sister? I think so. Is there anything else? No. That's all. Waltz. Checking. One record. Clinical studies. Substance 1354. Study abandoned. All patients discharged from the center. Look through all the names. Uh, patient discharged. All of them? Yes. Damn it. No info on where they ended up. Or about this substance. Uh, 1354 or something? I'm sorry, Aiden. There's more. The substance was also tested on some infected at GRE facilities across the city. To no avail. The project was run and supervised from X-13. It was eventually shut down, as was X-13 itself. Is there anything more about this X-13? In here? I doubt it. But I heard about it. X-13 was a hub of GRE operations. And the substance, you know what it is? There were so many tests and clinical studies, Aiden. Let me search the database for the research data. Something's wrong. What do you mean? It says a procedure's been initiated. Another procedure? I'm looking... Lots of data. Started, then paused... 11 years ago. Resumed a few days ago, in X-10. There's also a map. <laughs> Several locations are marked, including the observatory. What the hell does it all mean? I have no idea. Intruder alert. Intruder alert. Inf infected? They must be here somewhere. I don't got time for the shit. They must have followed us. There's no time. 
Hurry, take the key, hide yourself somewhere, and lock yourself in. I'll deal with them. Aiden, we don't know how many there are. I'll handle it. Yes, sir. Listen, boys, I'm in a pissed off mood. Y'all picked the wrong time to fuck with my ass. Ooh, we're playing stealthy. Yeah, okay. I'm kind of pissed off, though. I kind of just want to go loud and proud and whoop some ass. Oh shit, where'd you come from? Come on boys, bring it. That's not what I pressed. Oh, you're gonna be a pain in the ass. Get your ass out of here for a minute. We'll deal with you. Yep, you're dead. Yeah, sit the fuck down. Loot you guys up. You're empty. You broke ass. Ah, someone's got something on them. Bracelet. Nice. Alright. There's a fourth one. I don't know where he is, though. Some stuff over here. Mm, doesn't look like anything good for me. I will take that grenade. All job, I will take that too. Take all the stuff that I could use. Medicine. Alright, let's go. Monica? You alright? Yes. But I have bad news. These locations on the GRE system. They appear to be targets. Targets for missile strikes. Missile strikes? What are you talking about? The failsafe protocol. We don't have much time. Listen, this marks River End and Garrison. That's in the central loop. People live there. You have to warn Frank. Okay. Okay, I will. Hey, Frank? Uh, oh, Frank, your neighborhood is marked on some tactical map. You have to tell people to evacuate. What? There's no time to explain. Just clear everyone out of there, Frank. Shit. Okay. On it. Open the fuck up! Oh, you want more? Just wait here. I'll try to get through to them from above and take them out. You're safe here. Oop. And the power just went out. Awesome. Wait, is that a... Ooh. There's a lot of you. Might say I'm a fan. Oh yeah? You want an autograph? <laughs> I'll rip your hair. Gonna paint the walls with your guts. Let's go, bitch. There's a lot of you here. Hold up. I want that Molly. Actually, give me this. Oh shit, there's zombies. Zombies fucking his day up. I think you're going. Alright, we're good. I'm gonna really climb this shit again? Now, how do I get out of here? Uh, 
Oh, here we go. Hey, Veronica, I think it's safe now, but we have to get going. Veronica? I do have to climb back up, dude. Are you fucking kidding me? You saw how long it took me the first time. Oh, this is gonna be a fucking treat. <laughs> There? Well, it took a lot less time than I thought I was going to this time around. It's not there. Maybe this door. Veronica, talk to me. I had to get out, Aiden. I'm sorry. No way, you just I fucked us. I felt trapped in there. Oh, okay. Okay, where are you? Headed towards the elevators. I. Hey, Veronica? What's happening? Someone's here, Aiden. I'm coming. Oh, no. No, no, no! Veronica! She was here. That's no. Her Find her. You heard the boss. We're moving. You don't use elevators. Yep, too late, bitch. We're using the elevators. Veronica? Hold on. I'm coming. I'm gonna give Walt a piece of my my uh, blade here. I don't know what it's called, but he's gonna get a nice little taste of it. Talk to me. No, Hang go on, down, Monica. Aiden. I'm coming. Aiden, go the fuck down! Where is the key? Where is the key? <laughs> <laughs> Bitch! Sit your ass down. Run, sweetheart, run! Not one of these things, bro. You're scary as shit. Leave me alone. I see him down below me. I see him. I see him. Ah! Go, 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 Aiden. Open the door. Get away! Give me the fucking key! Give it to me! Go to hell, bitch! Ooh! Just run! I'll stop him! Why do you need this key, fucker? What have you done with me? Uh... Little boy. Oh baby, let's go! Oh shit! 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 He's no fucking joke. I'll kill you. Are you gonna block my shit like that? Hold on. How are you blocking that shit with your hands? Wait! I got I have a great idea. Back up, bitch! Oh, it doesn't work on you! Shit. Fuck. How's that shit feel? Bitch. Shit. 
That thing is annoying. Alright, we got him to half health right now. Ooh! What the hell's going on? Did we win? I know we're turning, but did we win? You should have died years ago. Oh, shit! What a throw right in between the damn metal bars. Aiden? Hold on. You'll be okay. Just hold on. Aiden. It's okay, Aiden. It's okay. Aiden. No! Oh my god. I don't have a face cam, but my mouth is dropped right now. Oh my god. Oh my god, we took off her fucking arm. Oh my god, in her leg. Oh my god, what the fuck did you do, Aiden? Oh my god, you mutilated her. You fucking tore off both her fucking legs. Showed you the truth. It's too late. Aiden, Aiden, where are you? Aiden, Aiden, Aiden. Hey, I got a signal here. Hurry, under that rubble. He's here. How did you guys get in here? There's chemicals all over the place. Aiden, stay with me. Who almost got the key, Luan? Fuck, Aiden, you're heavy. Almost there. Just hold on. Hold on. Dude, what a fucking... Oh my god. Oh, you're back. Thank god. You really gotta stop doing that. You had me worried, and I don't get worried. <sighs> Keep away from me, Luan. <coughs> wow. I mean, it's not like I expected flowers. But for digging you out from under the rubble and carrying you here on my back, a small thank you would be nice. You don't understand, Luan. I... You what? I, um... I killed Veronica. What? I killed her. And not only that, I'm turning. I saw Veronica's body. It was torn as if by a volatile. You couldn't. It was me. <clears throat> Walter's experiments. Back then in the hospital, there was nothing in the GRE database about me. But about the drug Walter was giving us, it had the greatest effect on me. Walter told me that Mia's dead. I have to get away from here. I'm a threat if I stay to, not to everyone. What if he lied to you, and Mia's alive? And even if not, you didn't kill Veronica Aiden. That wasn't you. I repeat, that was not you. If this transformation is because of Waltz, then we're going to make him fix it. Got it? I'll help you. Wow. Waltz created the inhibitors. He must know how to counter their effects. What's that? Come on. Probably another building collapse. 
Jesus, this whole world's going to shit. Or city, rather. Oh my god. Oh, jinx. Dude, what the fuck? He's finishing what he started 11 years ago. It's Walt. He used the key. That's when this all started. What are you talking about? Dylan didn't want Waltz getting the GRE key. He knew the whole city would be at risk. And Waltz took the key from Veronica and escaped. Apparently he needs it for something else. Do you see now? You have to stop him. Him and Williams. No matter what. Juan, I can't control when I turn. Any moment now I can... When you feel something happening, just get to a UV light. I can't stop them alone, Aiden. Okay. Okay, let's get him. Now you're talking like the Aiden I know. Frank's taking Juan and Matt to the stronghold. He wants to meet with the Butcher. What? I had the same reaction. But he says that after the bombing, Williams contacted him and that he wants to talk. Has Frank lost his mind? That's why I'm going to cover their idiotic asses. You go to the fisheye. Maybe you can still talk Frank out of this stupid idea. If that doesn't work, I won't be far. Aiden? Nobody can know about Veronica. Remember. I know it wasn't you who did that. But Jack, the peacekeepers, they won't give a shit. They can't stop us. They won't. Going rogue, baby. Sweetheart, you want to give me a kiss or something? No? Alright. Well, guys. That was a hell of an episode. A very oh long one, to say the least. Frank. Frank. Hold on, we'll let them talk. Frank, do you copy? Well, I don't know about you guys, but that was definitely the best episode we have had. Not, uh, <laughs> not skill wise, but definitely the craziest episode at the end here. That was absolutely crazy. We got, first off, we got Lawan. We were sweet talked her ass. And then we got, we found the doctor. We went back to Old Villador, saw a bunch of our old people that we used to, you know, the old stomping grounds. And then we fucking fought Waltz. And we got into the database, so, I mean, shit. This was a jam-packed episode, and I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, be sure to drop a like on this video. Subscribe if you're not already. And I know I said we might have, like, five episodes left last video. I think we might only have, like, one or two. I think we're getting really close to the end of the game. Um, especially with what they're saying now with, you know, we have to end this and all that. I think the game's end might be closer than what I was previously thinking. So, um, yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy, like I said. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.